Hello everyone, Akemi here and welcome to the episode 4 of Balance Code. Without further ado, let us continue, shall we? Yes, we shall. Well, it's an afternoon in the lab. I look down in the window at the springtime campus, decorated with a beautiful sakura in big bloom. Meanwhile, the hanami covers below the trees are in peak party mode. So goes the short lived Sakura season. Hanami mo astaka asatte de owari desu ne. Yeah, guess so. Yeah. Bonne-chan, kyo no hanami wa sanka dekiru yo ne? Ah, so yeba kyo datta na. Mondai nai. Imasara no shitsumon ni naru ga I should have asked you earlier, but are you okay with alcohol, Will? Yeah, well, I don't know. I mean, I don't drink alcohol myself, so... And basically, I have a, I have a really low tolerance on alcohol or otherwise, as well. I mean, I don't... Only that I need, only that needs to do is basically for me to drink a half a uh, liter of um, alcohol kind of uh, beverage or something like um, cider, cider or something like that. And I'm already drunk, so yeah. So I have a little, little, very little tolerance of alcohol. My name our college football team won. Football team won. I'd always have lots to drink in celebration. <laughs> Wait, 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 what? That's good. My acetaldehyde dehydrogenase enzymes are usually unusual genotype. Hmm. So my ethanol metabolism doesn't work very well. Chinamini Bokumo Hain Garakedo, Hambuma Sejo, Yuri San Yuri San Sejo Gata Disney. Hmm. Half normal. Yeah, right. To put things simply, Susukake sensei gets drunk really easily, just like me. Yari senpai is a slightly weak drinker, and Yuri and I are average. So, then, this year, Yuri is ready to go. Yes, I'm ready. If you need help, you can call me. If you don't drink, you won't be able to work at work. Sorry, my mouse was on the screen all, all this time. I didn't even notice. Oh, sure. How does not one like April? April, as in the uh, Month. Is there some medical reason for that? Is there a common ailment among Japanese people besides alcohol plus reaction? Hay fever? So, it's not good. It's I get it now. In Japan, classes start in April, so it makes a lot of people feel down like he does. Yeah, that's true. I'm not sure if you're a 
学校や会社に適応できなくて憂鬱になることを5月病とよく言うが八重の場合は4月病ってことか。In Japan, we often call it May disease, that someone gets depressed from being unable to adapt to their new school or office. In Yaya's case, I guess it's April disease. In my case, I'm going to be able to do it in the same way. I'm going to be able to do it in the same way. I'm going to be able to do it in the same way. I'm going to be able to do it in the same way. <laughs> Doink! Air Senpai saunters off to the room with sluggy steps. That's May disease? Maybe the Japanese climate spreads a kind of melancholy mood in the spring. Sasakake sensei bluntly denounces that idea. You're not going to be able to do it. Uh huh. Great. So, that's it. Will you be able to do it? I won't if you stop talking in the、uh, third person. I will help you. Of course, I don't re refuse to escort a lady. I don't know enough Japanese food yet, so、um, I'll just help you out carry stuff. Well, Suzuki sensei, what happened to the other day was just an accident. There's no need to worry irra irri irrationally. Nakai-dan-sei-wa-mi-na-so-yun-da. 局地権名義で領収書をもらってくるのを忘れるな Alright <sighs> Hanami is more like a grand festival than a little home party So the small shops within the university can't keep up Yuri and I head to the supermarket outside of the campus Looks like a lot of other students are doing the same As we walk toward the store Pushing a shopping cart.、Um, one of Yuri's acquaintance, acquaintances calls out to her and they talk for a while. Apparently, besides Hanami, the school club, clubs are trying to recruit new members in full force. So things are pretty chaotic. To the hippie waiting, he's from Yuri's class and invited Yuri to go party, but Yuri told him no because of the lapse of Hanami. Why didn't she go? Are you good at sports, Yuri? I used to play basketball. For some reason, Yuri seems perplexed at how to explain the tennis club. Later, I'll find out that the main part of tennis club isn't to play games but to find dates. Well, then,、um, what should we buy? We stop at the drink section. There's wine and beer and spirits. Spirits? I look at the labels for the sake, but I still have no idea what's what. <laughs> wow, pretty amazing. I pick up a bottle with our university's logo on the label. Now, what's written here? I can read some simple kanji, but I can't even tell how many characters are written here with this fancy script.
pretty good name. Uh, how about one of each? We also pick up some regular alcoholic drinks, soft drinks, and snacks that Yuri picks out. Uh, don't worry, she'll be no problem. There are throngs of shoppers like us buying lots of supplies lined up at the registers. I changed the shopping cart direction to head the smallest line possible. After paying me, hurry back to the university with the loot. We enter the campus with Hanami supplies in hand. It's already late afternoon, so most classes are over. Under the Sakura trees, some people have already started partying. Tsurukaki sensei is standing under a sakura tree with a big tarp at her feet. <sighs> Professor, you could have just waited in the lab eh, until everything's ready. Mm -hmm. あ、ベルシアさんパイ先に戻ったユリに連れられて低温室まで作り置きの総菜を取りに行った。このことはあまり公言するなよ。どう考えても目的が必要だからな。I ナイスパイペ。クラッチングリターンズアロングユリ。極地系は少数精鋭主義なんだ。研究室を変わりたければ他の先生方に話を通しておくぞ。働かざる者食うべからずです。どうせ、ゆいちゃんが一番飲むん
からもらった酵母で作ったんですよ、うん、おい一応我が国の法律では酒造りには造酒の免許が必要になってるからなあまり大声で叫ぶんじゃないまったくもうベルさんは細かいことを気にしますねあなたは気にしなくてもいいんですよ重要なのは作られる酒には研究室ごとに味や香りに違いがあるってところなんですよ Oh, wow. Oh, really? Well, I pretend I like I don't know, don't know it's illegal moonshine. とにかく、ベルさんも飲んでみてくださいよ。日本に来て日本酒を飲まないなんて許されないことなんだから。Ah, <sighs> ah,、uh, my back. Ah.、Uh. Okay, I'll have a glass thing. I think I sniff of sake poured in my glass. Well, it smells normal at least. And I'm wondering, guys, if I'm trying to pull another prank with this. Nah, I'm quite in hesitating. I think it's over. What the? This is really good! So, I'm going to go to the next one. 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 I'm going to go Hmm. Suzukake sensei takes, takes a sip and keeps it in her mouth, examining the flavor and aroma. Ah, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do it. Oh, really? How is it different from last year's? I'm going to be able to do it. 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 高分子の連中にはもろみの絞り用の特殊シートを開発させましたからねまさに究極の日本酒ですよ First I hackled with some heavy drinking faculty Then I got the physics department to buff the rice for 100 hours, hours. Next the high polymer teams to guys develop a special sear filter to strain the unrefined sake Truly an ultimate among Japanese sake. Heh. Iko ma yo. Kyonen mo itta ga, sai san o dogaishi shita kenkyu wa shiroto demo dekiru kara na. Sangyo ka ni tsunagara nai o fuzake wa goraku no hai ni tomete oke. Yeah. Mochiro. Hone no zui made wakatte mas kara te. Hmm. I don't know much about sake production, but. I guess these guys are kind of like gourmet seeking out the ultimate wine. Boku no kamoshita kuchikami zake da ってことだけで、すでにマニアの間では高値を呼んでいますからね。安心してください。赤字にはなっていませんから。Really? Kuchikami? What's that mean? Chewed sake? Sake? 酒造りの伝統的なというよりは民族的なやり方のことだワイン作りだって昔はブドウを絞る前に素足で踏んでぐちゃぐちゃにしただろうその類のことだ、hmm. If something is created by human hands it's unavoidable, unavoidable that some sweat or dirt will get into the mix It wasn't too long ago that they used human waste as fertilizer in Japan. Just brushing these techniques off as gross is like throwing away the history of traditional agriculture and manufacturing. <clears throat> Yuri opens the lid of a lunchbox. Steamed shellfish. Spinach, crabbing, fried chicken, fried fish, and more. None of the food is too fancy, but there's a lot of it. Yuri, 
es el que, que se enseñó el release de Pink Trunk. Did it she only take a sip earlier? Yes, if I bring his face close to my ear. この人すごい泣き上手でこうなったら子供と同じだからあとは適当にあしらうのがいいですよだから私はよっぱらってなどいないの Yeah, right. You're a lying bastard. I'm telling you, I am not even drunk. You're clearly, clearly drunk already. <laughs> Jeez. The sun hasn't even set and she's already this far gone. I'm gonna get my drink on too. Now two of them are super drunk. And what the hell is wrong with you, Suzuka Sensei? Why do you keep opening your mouth like that? Okay, I think you've had enough, Gaia Senpai. It's been quite a while since we started drinking. I noticed some groups around us have stopped partying and are heading home. I don't want to. Senpai, that's a shell. How am I supposed to chew that? Oh no, watch out. You're knocking over an empty bottle. <sighs> yep, those two are super drunk. Suzukake and Yaipo are super drunk right now. Even you can see it, right guys? Now <laughs> Senpai acts like he's even he's not drunk. But the alcohol boosting his weird personality up by about 30%. Yuri can hold her alcohol better than I expected, but she's still acting more aggressive towards Yai Senpai than usual. Guess that's how it goes when you drink that much. Well, really, they aren't acting all that different from usual. The lady over there is the real problem child. Wow. <sighs> Hell. I see. She's the kind of drunk who's not gonna remember a thing after she sobers up. Why is it my fault? I've been avoiding Yeah, I like it. Like a crazy. I don't even like boys. Like, uh, but I mean in that kind of way. Why are you accusing me, Suzukake? <sighs> Suzukake-sensei, that's not me. That's a tree trunk. 
I think you've had enough sake for a day. She probably just picks a fight with anybody when she's drunk. I better keep my eye on her. She's twisted. <laughs> Looks like she's just about at her limit. Her posture droops and I carefully lean her up against the tree trunk. <laughs> The other two trunks are passionately arguing about something. Um, what's going on on YouTube? Uh, what? What? These guys are getting more and more annoying. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna so use this as a screenshot. I mean, and thumbnail on this video. I'm so gonna use this one. Oh man, what on earth is going on? <laughs> <sighs> wow, based on pull on my arms, my sleeves are getting all stretched out. <laughs> Someone save me! I try to untangle myself gently, but I'm up against a couple of lushes. Now I said by trips and head but a couple walking on the path. What are you going damn fool? Unfortunately it looks like the man fell and hit his head on the ground. His rage is understandable. Things are just getting worse. On top of being on top of this being his fault. He provokes the man further. What's with that kid up? Is this how you apologize to someone? Has Yuri sobered up? He looks pale as she asks for my help. I'm sorry my senpai caused you trouble. He's just drunk, so let this slide. Why do I have to bow in an apology even though I didn't do anything? But if I left them alone, who knows how far this fight will escalate? Yeah, you're being a bit too violent right now. You need to calm down and head home and sleep. Senpai, calm down. You need to cool your temper. Now Senpai picks up a nearby bucket and rests it over his head. The cold water inside has ice cubes floating about. Hansen by holds it holds the bucket of ice water over his head. Yeah, I said, but that's dangerous. I, I I managed to get the bucket away from the ice by, but I'm not exactly sober either. I'm about to drop it. <laughs> this is so cold. I trip while I carry I trip while carrying the ice bucket. I said by poison laughs 
as I'm bathed in ice water. Just whose fault does he think this is? I'm about to chill out just yes, by when I'm interrupted by my own sneeze. Okay. Yuri asks me in worried voice, but yes, Semper starts gripping his stomach as he cracks up. He's pissing me off, but I've gotta try up before anything else. <coughs> okay, I'm gonna check how far we are. I still episode four. Okay then, let's continue. I'm gonna, I'm gonna re record until I freeze to the um. Episode 5 uh, It may be spring but the nights are still cold I head back home and take off my wet clothes Take a nice warm shower and put on some new clothes When I return to the university I see a light coming from the lab window I guess the Hanami must be over So I head towards the lab I'm warmed up with a shower. I'm fine, thanks. Looks like all the members in the Polar Research Lab are here, but only Yuri is sobered up. No, I haven't. Sukake Sensei and Yaya Senpai are dead, drunk, and dreaming about something. Seems like the Hanami ended right after I left. Um, by the way, did you get them here, Yuri? I can't imagine them walking all the way to the lab in this state. Yet Yuri is really strong enough to carry both of them. Just as I asked, there's a knock on the door of the lab. Who could it be at this hour? When Yuri answers the door, a man in sunglasses and black clothes enters the lab. He looks extremely shady, and he puts me on the edge immediately. Yuri, however, is com completely unfazed. She looks like she knows him. The man faces us and bows, then leans over the eyes and by. Once he confirms Yai Senpai won't awaken from his from shaking his shoulders, the man lifts up his petite frame. <coughs> now then, we will take Yai Sama back. I shall probably greet the professor as well, but she appears to be resting. The man in black carries Yai Senpai out of the room. However, as soon as he leaves, another man like him in black clothes enter, enters. Are these guys mass produced or something? I look at Yuri and she's still calm. So maybe I should relax as well. These are your belongings from the Hanami. The garbage has been disposed in accordance with the university's rules. So no need to worry. Thank you. Yet another man in back clothes appears and presents me with a thick envelope. You seem to be yours and best classmate. We've prepared this to cover your cleaning bills. Please accept any extra as a symbol of our, uh, our apology. Thank you. After the mystery men have headed out, I asked Yuri. Um, Yuri. I hope you don't mind me asking, but who are those men in black? They are the guys who work in Foyasa's family. They live and work in this household. Uh, oh, I see. I had no idea Yaya Senpai was the, was the son of a wealthy family or something like that. Hmm. 
元は生駒家の土地だったって昔八重ちゃんが言ってたよ Just how rich is this guy? Just when I remember those guys like maybe it'll be wise of me to avoid bumping heads with the Iceland by in the future. Circumstances <laughs> still doesn't look like she's waking up anytime soon. Hey, maybe those guys should have taken you and Sifukake Sensei home too. I decided to stay around for a while too. By the way, uh, do you live together with Suzukake Sensei? So she's like your foster parent. <laughs> that is unexpected. Good point. After seeing her get wasted today, I can understand how she's lazy at home. Eh, she even the super genius that is that has the pride of the university as a big point. If you forget that she reeks of alcohol, Suzuki Sensei looks like a kid sleeping after playing it all day. Hmm. Mostly. I feel like I know everyone a little bit of, thanks to today's Hana Hanami. <laughs> Pretty much all of that will be thanks to you. Mm, okay, I'll have some black tea. Yuri heads up to the kitchen with it with that remark. Yuri. Yuri. Suzukake sensei still doesn't look like she's ready to wake up. Thanks. We bought sip from our hot paper cups. Yuri shrieks and sticks out her tongue. Are you okay? First freezing now burns. We're not doing so well with the lab safety, are we? <laughs> oh god. I love this game. I. Ugh. This is a really well made game. Well done, M2 and Dogesaka Lab. You done it again. I love it. <laughs> I wonder if Yuri's tongue got burned. Hey, Will, can you take a look? <laughs> Yuri opens her mouth and sticks wide and sticks out her tongue. I don't think a cute girl like her should be making a face like this. Hmm, I don't see anything usual. If it was a bad burn, I don't think you'd be so calm about it. Uh-oh. Huh? Uh-oh. sensei I thought she was totally knocked out, but at some point Suzukake Sensei must have woken up. <laughs> no! It was just misunderstanding, Sensei. You're the one who's taking things too far. Sukuka Sensei won't even listen to my explanation and keeps nagging us until it gets late. And so my first Hanami was very impressive and absolutely unforgettable. 
Well, that was a long episode. <clears throat> okay, save. All right. Um. Wait, what did it say? All right. Okay, so um, I'm gonna leave this episode here, and um, yeah. Um, I really like this episode uh, so far. It's really well done game and uh, I don't have anything else to say really other than it's it, it's a great game. You should definitely uh, definitely buy it and you know play it yourself. So yeah um, until next time I'm Akimi and I'll see you later with more malice code to come but until then i'll see you later have a great one bye bye